Hello everyone, my name is Yogesh and today I will help you in making animated cards. Uh, you will find lots of le lecture and tutorial over internet but none of the lectures will provide you an easy approach in doing this because most of the time you will find that all these tutorials do have some easy, uh, are using like some of the image editing tools like Photoshop and GIMP if you are not familiar with those so uh, you will face difficulty in generating these cards. I was working on this one from last three months. I have generated this card from Photoshop and GIMP also, but uh, I found some of the tools which are which can make you um, which can help you in making this card, uh, and you, you can create this card on just some of the click of your mouse. You don't require any extra skills. What you require is you just require your creativity, the icons you choose, and the card you want to make. So before starting this lecture or giving this instruction uh, to you. You uh, let me show you some of the output of this, like this one. This is two image animation, animated cards. Uh, there are three things. First, this base image. This is a base image, and second is the grid uh, grid image, which overlap this one. Uh, now, this is two image animation. Now you can go for four image animation also. Uh, pardon. Now, if you will see, we have this four image animation. Pardon, what? Why this is popping up? Okay. Now we have this four image animation. Now going to next one. Mm, you can go for anything. The you must be the the thing you need is you must be creative. Like I love you, you love I, I love you. You can go for anything. Even you can make uh, some of the po uh, portraits with this one. Now if you will see, we can have this one too. Now going for this one we have two images animation again um, there is one more thing we can go for any four image animation so it is very easy with this software you can go for this let me tell you what software this is this software is Animbar you require this one you can uh, get it from Google you will just surf on Google and you will get the software or you can down, uh, download it from uh, my website also I will keep this in the icon folder uh, icon zip file from where you can download this Okay, uh, now start. Uh, let me show you uh, one. Uh, let me show you how to make this one. Uh, let's make this. I have this icon repository, so you can try and uh, learn from this one. So let we should make some of the. Okay, mm, but we can go for this. We can go for this one. This one. Uh, this one. Now you first of all you have to select these images and then you have to put in put those in sequence you want. Click on just compute, click on OK and click on this bar and you will find your animated graph. Now when you are taking print of this one, you have to take in two steps. First you have to print the base image on white sheet and then you have to uh, save this uh, like print this bar mask. Uh, this must be on transparent sheet. So that uh, that is the only reason you can have this animated uh, card. There is one more thing you should uh, keep in mind that all the images should be on same uh, of same resolution. Like uh, we can go for something like uh, like this one. Like this is having 286 uh, x 286 and this one is also having 286 x 286. But we will check this uh, resolution for this one. Now you have to just check the pop up or you have to click on this one and you can look. Here at bottom, the resolution is different. It is having 286 x 313, but I require 286 into 286. So, for resizing it, I will just right click on it and click on edit. Now, in my paintbrush, I have to go and resize. I have to go for pixel. I will uncheck this uh, manage aspect ratio and I will click on this one. And now I do have my animated like same uh, image for same of re same resolution. Now I do have my image of same resolution. Now I can again go for the animated image. I will just select the images from my folder as I want. Uh, okay, it's image nine. Image nine. I think yes, it is. And um, let me choose other two also. It totally depends upon your creativity, what you choose and how you manipulate those. Just have this sequence. Uh, sequence uh, just put in on any sequence you want and after that you can have this. 
animate image you uh, there is one more thing when you are taking print doesn't change scale of your image it will distort and you won't be getting any sa uh, you won't get any sa uh, same output so it's uh, for like printing on same uh, size you you can create using coral draw or photoshop or even you can go uh, into market and ask the person uh, at the print uh, print shop he will print on the same scale uh, just don't change the scale and also uh, print image in two parts first base image and then the mask on the transparent sheet i hope this lecture will help you in generating this or, uh, animation cards if you will like this lecture then just subscribe on my channel have a good day